We turn to snakes. We are warning you, you may see more snakes out slithering around around this month because September, it is a time for those eggs to hatch. Oh gosh, okay, we gotta talk about it. You and I both had our own encounters with snakes in our homes. I always say, I look around now, just don't feel quite as safe anymore, okay? A class though is being offered by the Phoenix Herpetological Society to help you better understand these reptiles. Our Jade Cunningham is taking this one on this morning. She's joining us live and telling us a little more about why this class is so important, Jade. Hey, good morning. Yeah, you know, you guys should have taken this class at the sanctuary if you guys are finding all these snakes on your property. Remind me to stay away from you guys as well. I want nothing to do with snakes. But one thing I have learned with this is that, you know, snakes really are these really interesting reptiles. You know, Arizona is a really stunning place. I mean, sunrises like this never get old. The scenery is absolutely breathtaking and the wildlife is quite beautiful as well. But there are a lot of things that we just don't know and understand about some of these animals, especially snakes, which is why a class like this is so important because the more we know and understand, the more we can live safely alongside them. So the Phoenix Herpetological Sanctuary offers many classes about different animals. One is called Venomous Snake Training. Sounds kind of scary, but it's actually really informative. You go and learn about these reptiles, and then once you get a better understanding of them, you can then learn how to safely remove them if they're somewhere they shouldn't be. This class looks to debunk common misconceptions about snakes. It aims at showing people how beautiful and important these creatures actually are. So we have rattlesnakes here. We have quite a bit of rattlesnakes and we remove hundreds of them every year from people's homes. And so there's a need. But I think uh, more importantly is people will try to move them without training. And that's how they usually get bit. Uh, people will, will see stuff on YouTube where people are picking them up by the tail and you just, you can't do that. And so, yeah, education is the answer. I mean, we, we can live safely around these snakes. Uh, we think we're making a big difference. Yeah, so this class will help train you exactly on what to do if a snake needs to be removed. It is for anyone 18 years and up. Now, if you see a snake in the wild, the best thing you can do, according to officials, is just take one big step back uh, and just kind of leave that snake be. And then also, if you find a rattlesnake um, on your property, just you can also call the sanctuary and they can give you more direction on what to do next. For now, reporting live, Jay Cunningham, 12 News Today in AZ. You know, I just might put that number in my phone yeah. just in case I ever <laughs> need it. Jade, we appreciate all that information this Tuesday morning.